Hey, um, back again. I've been trying to learn some chords. Sorry, you can't see my face. I just woke up not long ago. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to learn some chords. I've been practicing. Yeah, I'm going to let, um, play some chords A, D, and E because I just found on YouTube how to play it and it's okay. First of all, I'm going to face my first finger and place on the third thread. Third thread, right? Then my second finger on the fourth thread, and then my third finger on the second thread. Then play. I don't play the first one, just play this one. If you hear any buzzing, yeah, it's kind of fingers touching the thread, which I do a lot. <laughs> right, so let's see. So it goes. She sound clean like that. Then goes. That's A chord. The next one I've learned also is D. You leave your first finger on the third thread and place your second finger on the first thread and your th third finger on the next thread on the third thread of the next thing line thing <laughs> I don't know what it's called yet but yeah then you play you don't play the first the fifth or the fourth one you play from the fourth thread so it goes if you're in the sound you're not hitting the thread properly so you adjust just a bit to get it right Slide your first finger across, leave it on the, leave it in, leave it it's ah, leave it on the third thread. <laughs> Sorry about that. Leaving it on the third thread, then take your second finger, place it on the fifth thread, on the fourth. Is it one? One, two, three, four. Yeah, fifth thread, and the fourth finger on the fourth thread, and go. Okay, so far I've been trying to play this, so yeah. So I'm gonna play. I'm gonna shut up chords at random A, D, or E. A. slide it up which kind of catches the thread on my hand there so it kind of sound like this so I've been told that I have to slap my thumb down see you can't see it anymore so that way that I can get an arc like an arc there okay where was I again oh yeah okay I get very good at it. I tend to find if I place my first finger on this thread, it's kind of like a guide. So I don't have to look a lot without playing it. So I'm gonna play it again without looking. First of all, I'm gonna place it there, play it without looking. I'm gonna play A, D, and E without looking. Try not to look at my chords. So first of all, I'm gonna look first for the first round. Second round, I won't look. So it's like.
let's try again. Ah, let's get some muffled sound. Let's try. Ah, I don't know if you can see this. Yeah. Is it the, I'm dipping my finger. It kind of hurts. But yeah, no pain, no gain. <laughs> right, let's see. Okay. Spectrum or whatever you call it, that thing you used to play guitar. I thought I had mine in my guitar case thing. Obviously, I don't have it. I have to go and buy it. Makes it easier to strum because it's gonna damage my nail. So I keep strumming like this or my hand, whatever you call it. Okay, let's try. I don't remember the chord names, so I have to like say the chords before I play it, so that way I remember it off by heart by later my fingers forms it. Okay, I'm gonna play A. A is this, I think. Stay tuned. Um, if you practice, if you practice this also, and yeah, keep up and follow me playing the chords and follow my progress. This is like a progress channel. See how far I go. But yeah, I've got exams and stuff. I'm doing a cardio workout stuff like this. I'm very busy at the moment, so I'm gonna be doing only one video a week of me practicing this so yeah stay tuned and have a good day guys all right thanks bye